So we pulled out the heat exchanger. For this boiler, combination boiler. This is the old one. This is the new one. Um, so I was here on a service call and uh, and I had a, a screen mesh that's inside the combustion chamber that was sagging so low that it was grounding out with the with the flame rods. So whenever it would spark or have a flame, the, it would hit the wire mesh in here, which is for air and gas ratio mixing. So um, so I, I kind of pushed the mesh up a little bit with my flathead and then, and I could see the mark of the ignition. It was making a hole onto the screen. And then I pushed, I pushed this, these down a little bit to get it going until I got the new one. Uh, but I also checked combustion. It was high CO. And you see that discoloration? That shit right there. You can see that's bad, a sign of bad combustion. So they've been, Navian's been getting rid of like the problems and stuff slowly. They're making their product better. And then right here, I think the cause of the, that was mostly because these pipes here were sagging at one point, big time. And it didn't let the exhaust, it didn't let it exhaust out properly. So it gives you, it gives you an error code every so often, but basically it's like a restriction. So Navian gets you 10 years warranty on heat exchangers. So they, so they sent this one out. And so like, it ran like that for like three, three, maybe four years with those problems. And then I came and I corrected those, the, the venting and I corrected the manifolds. The manifolds were wrong. The primary, primary manifold was wrong. So just a word of advice. Whenever you um, complete the maintenance once a year, like clean the heat exchangers, check the combustion, do the whole maintenance, clean air filters, clean sensors or change the sensors, stuff like that. But if you're on a budget or you just don't want to pay, <clears throat> um, at least check it before the warranty expires. The warranty on the combination boilers is 10 years. So that sagging of the screen inside, the mesh, usually Navian has checks, makes me send them pictures of everything to make sure everything else is correct. And um, They want me to check, make sure everything's correct. And so this this fresh air was no longer use either. So I think before there was cross contamination with the fresh air and the exhaust too close. So I just, now another thing that I did, um, we just pulled from inside instead of out here. So they want you to clean every, every uh, once a year at least. Some people don't do it every year. So just make sure you get a check because once that warranty is up, now you're screwed. Now it's not even worth changing the heat exchanger probably just better off changing the whole unit to be honest because look we had a tarp we have moved everything and if it's not on the warranty then you might as well just pull the, the whole boiler out and just put the connections at the bottom and up top it's gonna be um pretty close as far as labor 
But let me give you a heads up too right here. You see that? You see the 17 there on the serial number? That's when it was manufactured. So I'm gonna give you warranty from that or from when it's installed. And usually, if your contractor's a fucking decent contractor, they're gonna register the, the boiler the same day they install it. Conavian, and you tell them what you installed, how you installed it, if it's natural gas, propane, if you're using primary manifolds, if you're using their manifolds, they document all that stuff. Um, they ask you about the venting, make sure you did everything correctly. Obviously, if you're gonna cut corners and all that, you're not gonna, you're gonna people are gonna lie to them or tell them whatever they wanna hear. But then a lot of this stuff, if there's not done right, they're gonna avoid the warranty. So that, that's why they ask you for um, pictures of everything or videos. So sometimes doing the cheapest is not the best because they're gonna cut corners, guaranteed, like they did here. So you save up front, you're gonna pay for it later. Um, just keep that in mind, but always get it checked. Like I said, the, I'm pretty sure the hot water heaters are 15 years warranty, heat exchanger, five years parts. Boilers and combination boilers are usually 10 years heat exchanger, five year parts. So I think the newer ones are seven year parts now. But you'll have a good idea if you buy a house and you have an Avian, you can always check around here and it'll give you the, the, the year it was made or manufactured. Amiga's over here waiting for me. All right.